In this video, I'm going to show you how to use advanced custom fields with Beaver Themer. Uh, right now, we're looking at the post edit screen for my homepage, and you'll see that I've created uh, some advanced custom fields here. I have uh, two text boxes, and then I have a gallery um, input here. And I'm going to go ahead and populate these. Um, so this will be for the heading for my page. Um, and then this will be the subheading. And then we'll go ahead and add a couple images to our gallery. And that should do it. All right, so now the real fun begins when we get into field connections with Vance Custom Fields. And to do that, I'm gonna go over to um, the Builder uh, admin page and go to my theme layouts and I have this transparent header layout that I've already created um, for another demo on doing transparent headers and you'll see that it's actually being applied to single pages uh, home page and also to my about page and so I'm just gonna go ahead and pop the builder open there and I have two heading modules that aren't populated right now because they actually were tied for that last demo to a custom field um, so instead of tying them to a custom field, I'm going to go ahead and choose an advanced custom field. And we'll just go ahead and click that. And I'm going to choose my field type, and then the field name is heading. And we'll click save there. And you'll see my headings getting populated, and then same for this one here. Instead of a standard WordPress custom field, we'll choose an advanced custom field. This one's subheading. And there we go. Now, in terms of my background images, um, before I had this one connected to the um, featured image. Um, but what I'm going to do, since we have a gallery of images with advanced custom fields, is I'll go ahead and choose uh, background slideshow. And I'll go ahead and choose advanced custom field. And then put in the name of my uh, field. Slideshow. And now I have that connected to my advanced custom field, and you'll see it's actually pulling in for the slideshow on this row background. Um, the uh, images I chose in that advanced custom field gallery field. So you can create any number of different fields that you want, and then just go ahead and hook them up to pretty much anything that accepts a field connection. Um, like I showed you the row background, you can choose advanced custom field or for like the text fields and things like that, you can choose advanced custom field as well. So we're done here. Just go ahead and publish. And then I'm going to go back to my homepage and you'll see the data for our homepage is being pulled in. And that is using advanced custom fields with Beaver Themer.